Oh man. I was lost there for a second. Man, I went into like a panic mode. Yeah, the uh, I've never been here like when it's dark like this. And the last time I was in here, it was completely different. Oh man, guys, it is way too early for this. It is about 3, 3 30, 4 o'clock in the morning. We are up here at the Palenque Market. The, uh, the big market here in Angeles City. Lut is fruit hunting. Looking for fruits and vegetables this morning. She's in there by herself. Um, she can get a better deal without me, but let me check it out, guys. Like I said, it's 3, 30, 4 o'clock in the morning, and this place is already up and running. Gets up, gets running early in the morning. People come here. Trikes lined up outside. Inside there's trikes. Jeepneys lined up. You guys see it. This is one small area. I mean, it's all on the main road. They're parked. All in the back, they're parked. But this is it. Early in the morning. Take a little walk through. It's been a while since I've been up here. I don't know, it's probably been over a year since I've been up here. Little come up here without me, so uh, <laughs> she can get some good deals. Uh, yeah, little come up here, and uh, I don't go. I don't go with her. But today I decided to come up, walk around a little bit. For, uh, let's see, obviously we're in the fruits and vegetable area. I've never been here this early. <laughs> this is early. Kind of lost. Because usually when I come here, it's. It is light out. There's all your vegetables. Morning. <laughs> the, uh, this place is, it closes up around 12 o'clock every day. And the place is empty. It smells good in here. I don't know if it's the morning fresh air or what. Trying to look for something recognizable. Now we're in the meat section. Each area has its own sections. The fruit area, the vegetable area, and then you have your meats. You have your pork, you have your uh, fish, you have your 
What else? Chicken area. Well, we are, we are, it's early, my voice. We're in the meat section here. We'll take a little walk through here. I hear all the whacking of the, of the cleavers going. I ain't gonna talk too much. I'm too, it's too early for me to ramble on. But uh, you get to see everything here. That's how they bring it in, I guess. Uh, I'll let you hear the hey, my bird. Hello, good morning. Hello. I'll let you hear the sights and sounds of everything. Chicken area. Your chicken. Good morning. There's all your chickens. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Good morning. Thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> the meat, the meat area has a its own distinctive smell. This guy.
let's go find the uh, seafood and, or the fish area. All right, now we're in the fish area. There's your tilapia, there's your squid. We're in the area where they sell the fish and squid and whatever else is in here. I don't know, some crabs. Them crabs are alive. They got tape over their claws. A lot of this stuff is coming from farms. Fish farms and shrimp farms and stuff. Your shells. I don't get run over. there for a second. Man, I went into like a panic mode. Yeah, the uh, I've never been here like when it's dark like this. And the last time I was in here, it was completely different. Uh, when you came in, your meats and fish and chicken and stuff like that were kind of like right in front of you. So I knew my bearings that way. Man, I got back in there and things just didn't look familiar to me. And, uh, uh, all right. and uh, man, I started like having like a little panic attack. I'm like, where am I at? I'm usually pretty good with my bearings uh, when I get in somewhere. But yeah, that, that one there, like I said, I, I went into like a little, a little panic attack. Like, uh, where am I at? I'm lost. I gotta get out of here. I was starting to freak out. Um, then I just kind of backtracked and found my way out. Um, but yeah, I always love going to these markets and stuff. I think they're so cool. Uh, especially this one here in Angeles City. It's huge. I mean, it is a big market. Um, there are other markets in the area, but none as big as this. And this is the one that most of the people go to. I can't believe how packed and how full it is. And it's coming up, coming up around five o'clock and it's still packed and it's still full. Um, and what's amazing is come up here around 
12, 1 o'clock in the afternoon, and it's empty. Like, they come in, they set up, they sell everything. Uh, what they don't sell, they take back with them, and uh, every day. 24, or not, uh, seven days a week. Seven days a week, this market is open. So, anyways, I'm going to wrap this one up. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the little walk around the market, and uh, we'll talk to you later.